Ball, you have to kick the ball back and forth between you and your cub. If the ball goes to the left, step left and kick it back. If it goes to the right, you need to step right, like this. Go ahead, throw the ball out there. See how many times you can kick it between you and your cub. may have sniffed something out. Let's check the map. Awesome! 
You remember what I said earlier about the shallows? That the water was coming from a well. This must be it. The ancient well. It was built by people who lived on the island long ago. The captain always called them the first people. I've actually never seen this place, but I've heard that it's a great spot. Do you want to go? See? Maybe the ancient well sends out a special scent. Wow! <laughs> There's no holding your cup back. Come on! Whoa, careful, little guy. This hill is steep. Hey, wait up! Beautiful. Let's go down there. The aim of this contest is to kick the ball toward the bubbles. Kick the ball when it gets close to that white line in the grass. Step left and right to line up your shot. You did. You did great! That's your new high score! A bronze medal! You're getting better and better! Do you want to try again? How you did. You did great! That's your new high score! A gold medal! It looks good on you. Would you like to try again? Where did it go? Huh. Did you hear a splashing sound? <laughs> that must be nice and cool. I think your cub will want to come back here. Wait up, fuzzball! <laughs> Did 
Did you hear that? There! Your cub heard it, too. No, Kitty, it wasn't your own echo. Look up there! It's a clouded leopard. Where did the other kitty go? Where's the kitty? Where'd it go? Oh, this poor kitty needs a nap. Oh, here comes trouble. Whoa! There you are. This way has brought to you courtesy of Captain Blackwood, school for ninja cats. <laughs> I'm good. Would you like to keep playing with your cub or spend some time with the clouded leopard? You can visit your cubs in Fur Town anytime you want. Good choice. One gets to stay with you when the other goes back to play with its friends in Fur Town. You can visit Fur Town anytime. The cubs are always there and they love company. Anytime you want to have a look at the map, just open your toy box and hover your hand over the map button. Or just say, open map. Go ahead. Reach out to select the map icon with your hand. Hey, as you can see, the map shows all the places we've been to on the island. If you hover over the house, I'll show you something really cool. You can now visit the island shop. Go ahead, hold your hand over the shop button to go there. You're going to love what the lemurs have for sale. Almost every day, something exciting and new washes up at Fiddler's Beach. These lemurs are so quick that you can usually buy things on the same day they found it. See over there? That's the shop. Be ready. These lemurs are a bit odd. Here it is, the island shop in all its glory. It might not be pretty, but you can get just about anything you'll ever need right here. Hover over the icon to take a closer look. This guy is known as the Serious Lemur. He might actually be the only one of his kind. <laughs> Lemurs are usually quite chaotic. Let's go see what they have. Swipe to look at what they have. If there's something you like, just hold out your hand to have a closer look. Want to buy it? Good choice.
Welcome back to your home. If you'd like to take a look around, just swipe. If you'd like, I'll show you how to decorate your home by selecting the Decorate button. All you have to do is hold your arm out to the bottom right. Swipe to select that old newspaper bed in the corner and push forward to change it. Why not try that nice, soft-looking blanket there? <sighs> yes, that looks much better. When you're done decorating, just hold your hand out over the back button. When you get more furniture, use decorate mode to add it to your home. Then when you're ready to leave, just swipe to the island map and then hover to select. You can use this map to travel between all the places you've discovered on the island. And look at all the explorers. to come here a lot, to play games or just to romp around with the cubs. <laughs> Whether or not to play with the item by holding your arm out to the right for yes or to the left for no. Swing your arm out in front of you to throw the disc. Like this. Step left and right to change the direction of your throw. After you throw the disc, lean your body to control its direction.
Captain collected string. Wonder if... There, between the trees. Let me check me map. Arr. Oh, yeah. I remember that place. It's a beautiful clearing in the forest. Last time I was there, the place was full of bunnies. But that was more than a hundred years ago. Can we go? Look, there's one of the bunnies. Your cub must smell more bunnies. Come on, you'll have to run to keep up. Watch out, the log is probably wet. Wow, it's even more beautiful than I remember. This is the obedience contest. Get your cub to perform all the tricks that come up. Then you have to try and perform the right gesture to go with your animal's trick. It's really fun. Come on, give it a try.
a new high score. Congratulations. Great job, my gold medal winning friend. Would you like to try again? Oh. Do you see the meadows over there? That's where we should go when we get the chance. was always searching for treasure with his plunder stone. I remember the day when he found an ancient bronze shield here in the glade. <laughs> These kitties do pretty well finding their own food, but they like to be spoiled, so be sure to give them some food every now and then. To feed your animal, all you have to do is hold the food still and out in front of you. Your animal also loves to play with its food. Wave some food in front of your pal, then try to wrestle it away when it tries to grab it. <laughs> Feeding is an important part of keeping your animal healthy and happy. You'll get more food later to feed your animal. Look at this! Your cub found the captain's plunder scope. He was looking for this forever. It's an amazing device that can find all kinds of treasure hidden in the ground. The plunder scope is a great way to find hidden treasure. Hold the scope still over anything you find. I think your cubs found something. Help dig it up. Well, go on. An oil lamp will help you light the way at night.
Soon you'll have the whole set. I think there's still treasure to find in this area. Those have bugs fossilized inside. Does that one? I think we found all the treasure there is to find in this area. Let's move on. Oh, <laughs> 